standards. There's no question about that. And this is what they're going with, with the German to Stegen. It is a bit of a new look on the back line, Sergio Roberto, but get used to it with Alesh Vidal out for the season. Mukhtiti expected to slide over with Machu at his normal left spot and Dinia out wide. And then who plays where? Rafinha Rakitic and Gomes. And many questions even deeper than that in the midfield. Few questions up front, MSN. They had some assistance down the line, and Francisco Saiz is the fourth official. Talk about new players, Iago Eredin, the invisible man, making the move over one of two goalkeepers new to Leganes. Siovas, the Greek, Tito, the veteran, also getting the start here today. You kind of have an idea there have been a lot of changes at the start of the season when there might be more players missing from the starting line at graphics than there are out there. El Sar brought in on a free from Las Palmas in January and Miguel Angel Guerrero the man from Toledo ex-Real Madrid plucked away from Luis Enrique's old sporting Gijon we are underway a swing of the leg of Suarez gets us started and it is Mathieu on the left Zaragoza for the 25 year old midfielder Coming back, Rafinha has that mask to protect his nose. In for Neymar, down for Suarez, flips to the middle for Messi. ABC, one, two, three, and Barca's in front in the third minute. Well, ruthless is Ming the Merciless. Three minutes in, Barcelona opened their account. It should be raining goals here today, as we said in the previews. The chasm, the abyss between the class of Barcelona is personified right here. Neymar dreads this ball. It's a good call by the referee's assistant. They keep the flag down. Suarez sees the Argentine coming in, and it's a pearl of a pass. Take a look at this again. Sees it. He doesn't need to look again. Trusts the outside of his foot. This is a magnificent pass. Just adjusts his big frame, and the Charrua puts this one on a golden altar for Messi. Chance inside for Suarez and quick off his line, Herodin. The decision, Herodin. The ex Herodin, six foot two, about 200 pounds. Getting nice a little bit of silver ball there from Tenth minute winding to a close Messi driving it in but over everyone goal kick DK looking on in the back was there Started the season at Granada the ex Rio defender good ball inside has the angle on Dinier Elzar one on one with Ter Stegen who slams the door shut Elzar again goes low Saved by Ter Stegen and cleared by Matsu. Well, it looked as if Ter Stegen had wrongly stayed away instead of accelerating out. Take a look at this. The ball just played out of the over the top. And Tiddy's right out of position. That's where I thought Ter Stegen had the chance to come and accelerate off. But he trusts his position, holds his position. Maybe a consistency that's ball. been lacking. Swept back by Suarez, but missed Rafinha on the run. Lovely ball. Yeah, you see, just a little rough off it. Doesn't quite get the clean hit off of it. Good ball. In stride for Suarez, looking to return it. Does. Flipped in. And then tripped up as the ball was slapped away. Fabulous ball from Suarez. Recognizing Messi's run and delivering an absolute red carpet pass. Take a look at this ball. One touch to control it, and then he sees it through the legs of... Minute. This will swing in towards Ter Stegen. Near post guarded, goes on the center, up and over Montovani. Wonderful opportunity for the equalizer again. Ter Stegen doesn't come. It's in his area. It, right there. He wonders, can I get it? Is that doubt? So he holds his position, probably smartly, but... ...with a fight. 
as we head to the half. Skips away. He's oh, Titi's on. down. Good oh, in. Poked away by Machu just in time. Wonderful telescopic tackle by. Was in the way. Or was there contact? Sweet a little touch. bit of a lucky break there, Leganes. But heard some of the fans hoping for the halftime whistle deflected inside cleared away said hey, hey. are on the volley oh. deflected and reaching back to staying in the same Guinness Elzar with a wonderful touch and a lovely hammer blow that one would have been going in had it not for been for um titty take a look at this again when it comes back, it hits some titty. That one's going away from Tistegan to his right side. It takes a deflection off um titty after that good block. And then Tistegan's able to get it away. Barcelona, once again, not answering the questions. And there'll be questions in the locker room. Leganes has shown up. Barcelona, not so much. Second half underway. No changes. Well, at least not in person. Manager won seven trophies without the great Carlos Piola. That's a good ball. Now comes Suarez, but Iago got there first. Barcelona whistles are definitely showing they're not happy. You better, watch, you better hold those woods. Guerrero! And what a stop by Ter Stegen again. What were you saying about the white hankies? Winning it back though, Gabriel, and into the waiting arms. This has been far, far from a vintage performance this season. And this year, it's been a lot of this. Two way out. You heard it in the tunnel talk. Let's go down, let's go down fighting. Let's really wear ourselves nice. with pride. Look out. Messi to Neymar, kicks in by Iago Eredin. That's four for him. You need, he hasn't really needed to bring out anything special. What a ball. Dropping it in on a dime for Simonovsky. Off balance and just off target. Dan, simple as it gets. Play the ball over the top. This is what I was saying that they needed to do more of. Just hit that space behind and release the hound. Back to Stegen. Matthew can't Ooh. get there. He reaches out and touches Guerrero who goes down. And the flag and the whistle are silent. Foul. Beautiful ball into the cow's field. He's in. The little touch on him is enough to push him down. Not push him, but it looks as if he clips his ankle there, whether intentionally or not. I think Mathieu's actually gambling a little bit because he knows he ain't going to have much to lose if he the chance again from Leganes. In for Rafinha. Dances around one. Overslide Shobas with the touch. Rafinha cleared away. Diego Rico saves the day right back to his keeper. It's a brilliant run from him. But does he have an option on the inside? Take a look. Brazil to Brazil. Neymar finds him. Right here. Can he pull it back for Suarez? Right there on that final touch. He's got him open, but he cannot find him. Applaudable effort. Unlucky Guerrero. Unlucky like if, an S. If that had been a foul, it likely would have been an ejection against the Frenchman. Instead, still one nothing, and Ter Stegen needing to stand strong. Well, you what? Roberto poke free. Oh. A chance falls. Ter Stegen looking to stay. Nice. Played square. Oh. Oh. Ter Stegen, but it won't be denied. It's Unai to cap off Machis's pass. The substitute, the substitute comes in and creates helter skelter chaos. A goal that has been coming and stinking up Capno like a bad fish actually now looks like a beautiful aquarium for Leganes. Good play again once Sergio Roberto coughs it up right here. Dwelling on the ball, he's got nothing in terms of an option, and that's why he checks it, comes back, and he's pickpocketed by Guerrero. Wonderful play here on the pullback, and a slot home finds its way in. Pass to Stegen. 1 1, and nothing less than totally deserved by the cucumber growers. 
who are sticking their cucumber in a very simple Messi focused and determined Neymar most likely just a decoy it's Messi looking up looking over and looking askance instead of Iniesta or maybe in addition to Dennis Suarez also ready to come in Busquets suspended, Turan, Mascherano, and of course Vidal all injured. Who probably could have had one or two in the first half. Again, wonderful play from Unai. Oh, chested by Gabriel and smothered by Ter Stegen. It's an intense in. Not sure what he was trying to do, maybe Suarez, but it deflects to Messi into the area. Neymar flips it back with Iago out. But no one can get the shot away. It's contact oh. made on the goalkeeper as well. A reach in by Neymar. It might have caught, and I think Neymar realizes it as well. Brave goalkeeping again from the ex Atletico Bilbao man. Gets his gratitude extended from Rico. Pushes in. And the hips come in. Nothing too bad there. It'll be okay. Don't forget a complete recap. Inside. On track. Neymar. Taken down by Montovani. And it will be a penalty. He tempts fate once too often. Someone needed to take a chance. And who better than the Brazilian? Neymar squirts around the first defender. And the ball gets away from him. He's on his knees already. Neymar's running into him. The referee's opinion, this is an intentional body check. It's right in front of him. Uh, it's a debatable one, but the Barcelona fans will be relieved. And Leganes fans will say we were robbed. Well, taking penalties has been an adventure for Barcelona in recent years, but Messi two for two so far this season. Iago Eredin to save the point. He stopped one of two. It's Messi from 12, and he will not be denied. Barcelona back in front. Full confident thrust. Executes with extreme prejudice. A lovely pummel home, but doesn't erase anything for a lot of people. The penalty itself will be called into debate when the man's down on his knees. Was it intentional? It doesn't matter. Messi's magic comes in, as I said, the medicine man. And no celebration by him either sees it and then absolutely pummels it but there's nothing there in terms of celebratory football from him halfway through the time added matches to the middle awkward oh nicely falls for elza oh! Oh! and it whistles wide oh so close hearts in his mouth not one half a dozen yeah he can smile but he'll not be applauding much after this game. Wonderful from Elza. Cracker Jack hit, and it's a foot away from absolutely bringing this town down. Just a fraction away. And still have not been whistled for one. I don't think you can pin it on the referee, but Barcelona have to consider themselves fortunate. 2-1 against Leganes. I'm not sure, Phil. I think a lot of people will be pinning it on the referee. That is highly debatable, but it doesn't matter. It's all gossip now, and the gossip mongering will continue.